Hey folks, how's it going? Thanks for checking in with Down the Road Show. I am coming to you live from the Four Point Sheraton here in San Diego. I am here with uh, fellow nerds on a gorgeous California Saturday to enjoy this San Diego Comic Fest. Now, I travel around and go to a lot of Comic Cons around the country. And let me tell you why San Diego Comic Fest is a great destination for you. This is a small event, so if you can't get into San Diego Comic Con, like the 100,000 nerds that are trying to get in there every year, this is a great small event to come to. Now, if you're a first time Comic Conner and want to come experience this as a nerd, that's why this is a great event because it's nice and small. You get these big aisles, it's not overly crowded, there's not a ton of people here yet. Uh, so there's room to roam. You're gonna find all kinds of great new artists you've never heard of, toys, games, all kinds of things to collect. Uh, and, but on top of that, this place has some legendary artists uh, and creators for you to come check out. But also, what's great about San Diego Comic Fest is if you are not a first timer and you're a professional and you go to lots of Comic Cons, this is totally the Comic Con for old school nerds. So if you are a fan of old cartoonists like Scott Shaw, Alan Bellman, he's doing a panel right now, so worked with Stan Lee, doing all the great stuff, Captain America, so great. One of my personal favorites, Sergio Aragonis, I can't pronounce his name for crap and always mess it up, but legendary creator for Mad Magazine, through the Wanderer, love that. Over here, Stan Sakai, mm-hmm. Come on, Samurai Bunny, who doesn't love that stuff? So you got legends, you got new artists. That guy actually started San Diego Comic-Con and San Diego Comic Fest. So this is a great place to come if you're an old school cat and you just wanna come meet some of your favorite legendary artists and comic book creators or Mad Magazine, you know, whatever. Th this is definitely a place for professional old nerds. The conversations going on in every little corner is great. A lot of these cats have, you know, they know each other. They've been working together for years and they've been going around to Comic Cons for years. So this is a great place if you're a professional and you want to get away from the hucky muck of San Diego Comic Con. You can come here, buy yourself some comic books sell some comic books a lot of these people are also buying you know or or you can just find a cool person to relax and have a beer with yeah that's right it's, it doesn't have to be about comics you don't you know have a drink make some friends but anyway uh, highly recommend San Diego Comic Fest they got Artist Alley over there in a different part of the hotel great little setup like I said big walkways plenty of room for you to get through not a huge crowd and everybody here is super super friendly highly recommend this this is my first year at San Diego Comic Fest I'll be coming back year after year thank you for uh, bringing me out Matt Dunford and uh, so if you're in the San Diego area or if you want to come in like some people did from Australia some people drove in from Utah um, from all over the country cheap affordable this is a great weekend and a great event and you can come here and meet people like Mark Bode. So if you're a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles fan like I am, hey. come check out his booth and all of his cool stuff. So anyway, thanks for checking in with us. We're live at San Diego Comic Fest in San Diego at Sheraton Four Points. We'll see you later.